hey guys this free adobe ai tool is insane like it does most retouching for you especially when it comes to adding and removing so this particular one you take the insert tool right here and then you paint over this area because for this i want to change the pants that she's wearing paint over the area you want to change the pants like this area like this if you paint over an area you don't like you take your subtract and then you paint like this to subtract then you click on add to add the area you want to add so after making the selection like this come down here let's type something like long pants long pants and now click on generate and voila you get this amazing result you can now choose the particular one you want or you can even be more specific with your prompt like uh maybe you want the pants to be completely white you can come click on cancel long completely white pants now click on generate this time <laughs> and you get this uh i'm still seeing some colors uh, but you see that it's predominantly white now so that is just how the ai works and uh, it's not just limited to this uh, let's which are we going to keep let's keep let's let's keep this one the first one is is nice so we keep and now let's remove the background after removing the background let me show you something you can replace the background with something more creative let's type in something like spotlight at this point you discover that the whole thing is now limited to your imagination how creative your imagination is and the earlier you start messing around with this particular to the better for you so you can just start using it right now so that you grow with others you try a new prompt and you can see voila amazing background i see different spotlights this is nice and this is also amazing and if you are not okay with this you can still come and click on more for to generate new sets of background the speed of the generation depends on the speed of your internet connection so if your internet connection is slow you have to be patient if it's fast you just get the result inside and this is also completely free if you don't know how to get to this point or to this interface go on to your browser and type in adobe firefly adobe firefly and then click on the ai Art generator adobe firefly and uh, you'll be prompted to sign up or sign in which is completely free but because i'm already signed in to this particular site i'll get this option explore the new photoshop explore the firefly if you already have the official uh, adobe photoshop installed on your desktop you can explore the new photoshop to update it and get photoshop better and start even doing more creative and using the power of photoshop to take this ai stuff even further but if you don't just click on explore firefly and then you come to this interface and then click on generative field you click on generative field you wait for it to come to this new interface you can now go and drag and drop your image right here then you can start playing with it like we are currently doing on this on this particular interface so use the particular one that i think is nice or that i think you want and then you download it into your desktop to get prompt and after downloading this particular stuff you bring it into photoshop let me show you this one i previously worked on if you bring it into photoshop originally you see this stuff uh, you can easily remove it using the patch tool in photoshop if you have photoshop or even any editing software you have you can just use your patch to cycle around like this and then pull it to a neater place just like this so 
so you can clean it up and then uh, something you can also do is you can go and liquefy go to filter liquefy when you get to this prompt you can now adjust this funny looking part i think this came out due to uh what is it called my selection was not very all right that time so you can now liquefy so you see that this ai is not here to replace anything it's just here to enhance first thing and give us more power to do better in our creative process like it's giving us more opportunity to do more it's not taking anything away so don't be scared just join the moving train get on board a sap and become a great creative if you get this on your own photoshop if you update your photoshop you get the generative fee you can use that but for most of us who do not or who have not updated our photoshop you can just use this free option here so leave your feedback in the comment section like this video if you haven't already subscribe to this channel for more fun helpful tips tricks and photography photoshop tutorials and behind the scene happy to be part of your creative journey see you in another amazing tutorial